Ah, uh, the old Microsoft setup. And you might be thinking, Titus, haven't we been here before where Microsoft accounts are required to install Windows 10? Oh, okay, I already know, Titus, I got bypass NRL. Well, Microsoft, in typical Microsoft fashion, is getting rid of bypass in our own 25H2. So buckle up, buttercup, because this next month, Microsoft's forcing you to create Microsoft accounts to log into your computer that you technically own, but they own the software kind of thing. No, 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 no. Absolutely not. In typical fashion with Microsoft, there is always a workaround. And that's what we're going to do today. So normally, we would do Shift F10, pull up our prompt. And this is where you do a bypass NRO. And then you'd reboot the system. That's what Bypass NRO did. It actually added a registry entry into it. And then would just do a shutdown, timeout zero, and then reboot your machine. And then you could log in using a local account on Home and Pro. Now, many people are already running the comments and going, hey, I use a pro thing. I just hit domain join and then just don't join the domain and I just use a local account that way. That still works. So yes, if you're a pro user, fine. Um, but this is actually a faster way than all of it. It's even better than the bypass NRO. And frankly, I wish I found this sooner. So let's, uh, let's get into it. So shift F10 gets us our command prompt. The new command is going to be we're in here. We're just going to hit start space ms-cxh colon. And then we're going to go local only. This is the new bypass NRO command. We hit enter. Why it's better is it's going to prompt us for the thing. And we can just say our username in this instance, subscribe. We're going to go next bypasses all the prompts puts us right in. So if you're dealing with, you know, setting up your 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 dad's computer or whatever for him, and you don't want to deal with all those questions and then having to set up a dirty Microsoft account so they can spy on you. Well, now you can just do this simple command. You can set up these things like they would honor whatever you type in here anyways. I'm just going to hit no, accept, and then you can use, oh no, shut up. You can use my Windows utility, whatever you feel like doing to, you know, lock down your system and remove some of the telemetry that's in Windows. But this is going to save you a ton of time and also make it so you don't need a Microsoft account. As you see, when we look at this, we'll just have this. Oh, subscribe, local account. And this is using... Windows Home, too. I wanted to demonstrate on a, a system you normally wouldn't be able to do this. So we'll type WinVer. You can see this is just 24H2, but this does work on 25H2. I've tested on some of the Insider builds. So we'll see if Microsoft patches this out or not. But let me know in the comments what other cool things you've seen. And if you're interested, let's say they patch this out. No worries. We can recreate how Bypass NRO used to work by simply either typing in reg add through CMD, launching to PowerShell, we can do a lot of different things. So am I worried about this? Absolutely not. If anything, Microsoft just forced us to come up with a faster, better way. So thanks Microsoft for constantly screwing stuff up so we can even find better bypasses. So enjoy the new bypass on our own and I'll see you in the next video.